What's up, YouTube? This video is brought to you by Weebull. If you'd like to help out the channel and get some free stocks, make sure you check out my link below. Hey, I'm Chris saying in today's video is about stocks for beginners. Listen, guys, I get a bunch of new and beginning investors joining the family every day. And I want to make sure that I'm not leaving them behind and making sure that I'm getting them into the right place. If that's you, please stick around for this one. Listen, if I helped you in any way, but I was helping you make some money or give you a new perspective on the stock market, please make sure you like, subscribe, and join us on the journey. Without further ado, let's take a look at my portfolio. Okay, guys, two in one day. I'm back again, but this time it's all about stocks for beginners, guys. We had a decent day in the market. Not too much to write home about, at least on our end, but overall, the market is starting to pick up steam as I indicated to you all that it would beginning in April as we come out of this correction that we were in for the last six to eight weeks. Listen, guys, I got some plays that if you are new to the game, if you're just now getting your feet wet, there's type of plays you want to be in in order to ensure you have some early success on your journey okay so today is all about me sharing some of those with you to put you on the right track there's nobody in the game that's going to give it to you the way that i do so you can rest assured that with me that you're going to be in position to be successful right out the gate listen guys let's get right to it stock number one for my stocks for beginners if you are just joining the game or you're fairly new or relatively new Palantir, ticker symbol PLTR, is one that I want you to consider. Listen, if you don't know about investing, the name of the game is to buy low. So in this particular case, you would want to buy this on a dip, okay? So right now, when it's sitting at $23.54, you would want to get this around $22 or $23. And of course, it's even better if you can get it at $21 or $20, okay? Not saying it will fall that low, but I want to put you off top in the right mind frame that you need to be in when you're starting your investment journey, okay? So Palantir would be one of the plays that you need to get into. Also, Uber would be stock number two for right now at this point in time of the market, okay? Ticker symbol UBER, currently sitting at $57.99. This is another play that, again, in terms of just where the world is going, in terms of ride sharing, in terms of Uber Eats, you are in a great growth company that will do great things for years to come. This is, will be a play that you wanna add to your mix if you are new and just joining the game right now, okay? Listen guys, and last but not least is Square. Ticker symbol SQ sitting at $260.50. This is a FinTech play. Off top, notice how diverse I already made you. Okay, that's a key. You want to be diverse when you're getting in the game because if you are heavy or overweight in one sector, when that sector goes down, all your money goes with it, okay? However, in this balanced approach, you will do extremely well having this type of mixture and these type of plays that will all be successful as well as grow your money early and often on your journey, okay? So these three plays are three that I would recommend for any new and beginning investor or even if you have been in the game but you just kind of don't know what type of plays you need to be in. Please consider these three. Up next, we have our word of the day and our word of the day is portfolio size. Listen guys, if you are new, I want to first off tell you, welcome to the game. This is a game that I strongly feel we all need to be in. That's why I do my best to teach the game like no other and get more success than anybody that I can think of, okay? But listen guys, in terms of getting involved in the stock market, you want to make sure if you just starting off that you have one to three plays, no more than five, but based on the amount of money you have, you may only need one play. I often say if you come into the game with 2,000, 5,000, or even $10,000 as a minimum, please consider buying as few plays as possible so that you don't spread that money too thin. One mistake that a lot of people make is they come to the game and they say, oh, I got $2,000. I'm gonna buy five different plays. And what you end up doing is you got 200 here, 200 here, 250 here, 250 there. And before you know it, you're not having a real fully built out position. Over here, one thing we strive for is 125 shares minimum in every play, okay? It's hard to achieve that if you are spreading yourself thin across too many plays. And so I hope this is helpful to get you guys started on your journey, but more importantly, is to build the right foundation that you need to have to find success in the stock market. 
keep it low, keep it simple. One to three, no more than five plays, but if you got a limited amount of money, consider one play and go with the best one that has the chance to grow your money or double your money the soonest or the fastest, okay? Listen guys, up next we have our question of the day and our question of the day comes from Promise. Thank you, Chris, for teaching us to become sharks in the stock market. Because of your teaching yesterday, I bought two contracts for a $39 put on NEO and took profits at 212%. When NEO pulled back today, I have also bought a $38 car so that I can eat when NEO shoots up again. God bless you and give you long life for what you do. Promise this made my day, man. Guys, if you're new here or you are a beginner and don't know how things go down around here, I don't know anybody in the game that does it like we do over here. He's talking about a few of the home run option plays that I put him in. Obviously, 212% is phenomenal in anything, but again each and every day i teach guys how to be successful i teach individuals how to build real wealth okay and the success speaks for itself and so on the journey i love to see you guys thinking strategically playing chess not checkers he bought a put which i told the whole channel to do and we all had massive success with that for those that took profit at the right timing and didn't hold too long then he went out and bought a call in anticipation of the stock shooting back up which it did so i know even though i'm reading the comment now he should be somewhere making profits right now as well okay and that's how you set yourself up for the win-win that's how you always consistently dominate in the stock market no matter what type of market it is a bull market a bear market a crash or a correction i tend to dominate all of them and if you rock with me you will do the same in due time listen guys if you have questions or comments leave them below I'll grab them and add them to my next video. Listen, I make videos like this every day. So if you like this one, make sure you check out the next one. Remember, most people see the end result. Very few consider the journey. Do me a favor. Don't forget to like, subscribe to the channel. Make sure you guys grab some free stock using my link below. And I'll see you all in the next one.